No, no. This is just you and me. This isn't going anywhere. Okay. All right. All right. Uh, take a step to your right, just a little. Your other right. Yep. Are you looking at the camera or me? You. Look at the camera. Okay. I don't exist. Yeah. Look at the camera. So your your viewfinder is at the bottom. Yeah. Okay. Look at that. All right. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Look at that if you want. <clears throat> You're just talking to me. All right. Are you ready? Do it. Okay. Hi, my name is Nancy Lee, and I took an advanced fiction writing class with Kyle Miner last semester. And my honors project is to create three enamel pieces based upon Homer's The Odyssey, which is one of the books that we read in class. And um, very early on in the class, I had a dream and at the dream, there was a picnic, a family picnic, and me and my sister were there, al along with a bunch of other people, and there was a big Bengal tiger sitting right by us. And I was scared, and, and I asked my sister, I'm like, what is this tiger doing here? And she said, don't worry, he belongs here. So that dream informed me that I needed to embrace my discomfort, embrace my fear, and embrace the tiger. So that is the attitude that I went into this project with. And you'll kind of see uh, that as I talk about these pieces. So these are three six by six enamel copper pieces. Uh, vitreous enamel, which means ground glass fired at a high temperature in a kiln. And uh, then frames were made by Project Leah, which is a group of people who um, ha have been formally incarcerated and are learning job skills. So in my first go around on these pieces, I, uh, I had stencils and they were all, you know, cute little maps and arrows and compass roses and I enameled all of them on top of these pieces and when it came out of the kiln, I hated it. It looked contrived and amateurish. And um, I noticed that the edges of one of the pieces had a little crack and so uh, I thought, well, what if I just crack them all? I, I don't like the way this looks. So I cracked all of the surfaces and chipped off some of the enamel that was already fused. And then I went back with this liquid enamel here and I fired that into the cracks. And the way it came out, I, I really loved it. It looked like liquid. It looked like water. It looked like maps. It looked like a helicopter view of a foreign land. And um, then after that, I added this blue to look like waterways, which was really in relationship with what my view of the Odyssey was all about. It was about a journey. It was about travel. It was about being in nature. I had greens here to denote forests and wildlife. And um, you can see that there, there's a certain amount of dirt kind of in here too, the firing with the natural copper colors coming through the oxidization. So after I got all of these framed, and you can kind of see the, the background here, after I got all of these framed, I um, put them in the order and the orientation that I, I felt like told the story the best. And I'm pleased with the results. I'm pleased with my effort at embracing the tiger.